The mean corpuscular volume, or mean cell volume, MCV, is a measure of the average volume of a red blood corpuscle. The measure is attained by multiplying a volume of blood by the proportion of blood that is cellular, and dividing that product by the number of erythrocytes in that volume. The mean corpuscular volume is a part of a standard complete blood count. In a laboratory test that computes MCV, erythrocytes are compacted during centrifugation. In patients with anemia, it is the MCV measurement that allows classification as either a microcytic anemia, normocytic anemia or macrocytic anemia. Normocytic anemia is usually deemed so because the bone marrow has not yet responded with a change in cell volume. It occurs occasionally in acute conditions, namely blood loss and hemolysis. To calculate MCV, which is expressed in femtoliters, hematocrit as a decimal is divided by RBC. RBC is the quantity of erythrocytes expressed in millions per microliter. The normal range for MCV is 80 a euro 100 fl. For example, if the hematocrit equals 42.5% and RBC equals 4.58 million per microliter, then the following equation would obtain. MCV equals HRT RBC. MCV equals 0 0.425 slash 4.58106 slash 10 a euro 6 L. Then, multiplying both the numerator and the denominator of the divisor by 10 a euro 6, the divisor becomes slash 10 a euro 6 10 a euro 6 L. MCV equals 0 0.42510 a euro 12 L. Then, after inverting the divisor and multiplying it by the dividend, the result is slash 4.58, which equals 0 0.0928 times 10 a euro 12 L, which equals 92.8 times 10 a euro 15 L, which equals 92.8 FL. Use a volume-sensitive automated blood cell counters, such as the Coulter counter. In this type of apparatus, the red cells pass one by one through a small aperture and generate a signal directly proportional to their volume. Other automated counters measure red blood cell volume by means of techniques that measure refracted, diffracted, or scattered light. If the MCV was determined by automated equipment, the result can be compared to RBC morphology on a peripheral blood smear. Any deviation would usually be indicative of either faulty equipment or technician error, although there are some conditions that present with high MCV without megaloblastic cells. For further specification, it can be used to calculate red blood cell distribution width. Interpretation The normal reference range is typically 80 to 100 fl. High, in pernicious anemia, MCV can range up to 150 femtoliters. An elevated MCV is also associated with alcoholism and malafibrosis. Vitamin B12 and or folic acid deficiency has also been associated with microcytic anemia. Low, the most common causes of microcytic anemia are iron deficiency, thalassemia, sideroblastic anemia or chronic disease. In iron deficiency anemia, it can be as low as 60 to 70 femtoliters. In some cases of thalassemia, the MCV may be low even though the patient is not iron deficient. Worked example, derivation, the MCV can be conceptualized as the total volume of a group of cells divided by their number. For a real-world sized example, imagine you had 10 small jelly beans with a combined volume of 10 ul. The mean volume of a jelly bean in this group would be 10 ul slash 10 jelly beans equals 1 ul slash jelly bean. A similar calculation works for the MCV. 1. You measure the RBC index in cells UL. Take the reciprocal to convert it to UL cell. 1 slash 5 E6 equals 2 E minus 7. 2. The 1 UL is only made of a proportion of red cells with the rest of the volume composed of plasma. Multiply by the hematocrit to take this into account. 2 E minus 7 0 0.4 equals 8 E minus 8 UL cell. 3. Finally convert the units of UL to FL by multiplying by 10 9. The result would look like this. 8 E minus 8 UL cell equals 80 FL cell. Note, the shortcut proposed above just makes the units work out. 10 times 40 over 5 equals 80. References. See also, anemia. 
differential diagnosis, full blood count, mean corpuscular hemoglobin, 